the end of the year. Everywhere on TV, couples and Christmas trees, gift wrapping and cheese. Hey, hey, hey! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. We are currently going on a little haul. So we are off on a little holiday. We're going away for three nights. We're going to Chester and then Herefordshire. Yeah, so we are actually in a Tesla as well, which is so exciting. I did speak about it on another vlog, which will have gone live before this. So if you want to find out about how we've got a Tesla, why we've got a Tesla and all that malarkey, you'll have to watch the vlog before this. You will see snippets of it in this video as well, but the main vlog about the Tesla is the video before this one. Anyway, it's very exciting. We've had it for like, what, like a day now, haven't we? Yeah, last night we got it and we've been experimenting, playing some games, doing light shows. It's just unreal. I didn't realise what Teslas were like at all. Like, I'm not really into cars, so I'd never really looked at them, like, never really found out about them. You obviously knew more than me about, like, what they could do and stuff, but I'm absolutely blown away, aren't I? I'm like, wow, wow, I like that. <laughs> so I'm very easily impressed by it, but you'll find out more about that on the previous vlog. Anyway, we are heading to Chester. We're heading to a super car charging location um, just to get give the car a charge because we haven't... Oh, is that the one we're going to? What? No. That's one mile over there. Right. <laughs> that one mustn't have it then. It's an hour, mustn't unless you want to go on another one. Uh, yeah, so that is what this vlog's going to be. It is going to be a little holiday vlog. Me, Sean and the pups are in the back. They're just snoozing. So I'm very excited to bring you along. It's going to be a nice little trip. Our last trip of the year, really. Yeah. Nice little round trip to round it off. We went to Bainland um, with the dogs and that at the beginning of the year. Then we've had obviously a few holidays and stuff. Um, and then this is our nice little um, trip. Very exciting. <laughs> Okay, a little update. It's taken quite a bit longer than we expected. There's been a lot of traffic, hasn't there? That's the biggest part as well. We've yeah. Been in loads. We've been in loads of traffic and the map is just literally a red line. Yeah. So I think, yeah, we're not actually due to get there till 6.14 p.m. We set off at about one. Yeah. Um, we have did one stop to charge, which was only half an hour on the supercharge. That wasn't bad at all. No. Then we've did another stop because I needed the toilet desperately because I drank too much coffee and coke. So we stopped to go at the toilet. Sean took the dogs to stretch their legs. They're fine though. Like we're so lucky with them too, aren't we? Nah, just <laughs> they literally fine. just the car of them is just like, okay, that's my bed. I'll sleep. They just don't care, do they? They're so chill. Um, whereas my mom dogs, Dolly, she cries and cries and cries in the car. So we're so lucky that we can just go anywhere with them and right. they're great. Um, but not too long now, 29 minutes it's saying, um, to the first location, which is actually a little cabin. It's like a little wooden cabin. Um, it should be really nice. We're only here for one night though and then we're heading to Herefordshire tomorrow, uh, which will be really nice and we're going to be at that location for two nights. So I'm very excited. Um, we've got a few cans and I went into Weight Rose at the service station to pick us up a few bits to eat tonight. Well, we're going to stop at the supermarket, but I'm really glad that I got some stuff there now. Nice because it's just taken so long. Obviously, I hope everyone's okay and there's been no major accidents or anything like that. Um, it's just taken a long time, really, isn't it? Yeah. So, yeah, but we're nearly there, not long. I'll give you a little tour of the first location when we get there and then obviously show you what we'll get up to tonight. To be fair, it won't be much. It'll just be having our dinner and having a nice chill. Um, how you found driving the car, all right? Yeah, it's good. Yeah? It's, uh, proper comfy, lovely. Yeah. Just lovely to drive, isn't it? Um, but oh god, look up there! <laughs> uh, I think that's a road we're on. I think oh, that's a road we're on. That's not even. But it's took off, yeah. We're on this one, so whether. I don't know. Not sure. We're not sure what's happened, but it's just taking a bit longer oh, there. It's just red on the map. Yeah, it's all red. I'll show you. So this is obviously the map at the minute, and the road yeah, is literally all red. Um, Look at this little diagram. This is our car, and it like shows you the cars in front. And if people are there, they come up as well. Oh, it's yeah, so look, funny. Look, what? look at the car, right? Right. You see the brake lights are on there because ah, I go off. Ah, yeah, it's telling you. I'm accelerating, they're not on, and then my take the accelerator off, they go on. Yeah. So it is on. Mm. It tell you. This is our little cabin for the night. It's so cute. I found it on Airbnb. We've just got some chips in this like oven thing, and then I've got this um, cottage pie. Sean's having a curry and I got this just as like a side of like veg and stuff. Um, we are having a peroni between them. We've got some chocolate biscuits. There's a little telly. 
Henry's testing out the sofa and he says, you know, Matt, it's quite a good sofa because I've got a view of everything. This must have been um, the owner's dog, Max. Would you pause CEO, Max? Aww. This is like the first little living area and then you go into here in the bedroom. Sean's sitting on the bed because Henry took up the sofa. <laughs> We've got their dinner out, but they're always a bit funny when we go somewhere about eating initially. This must be their little dog, Max. Look, the little bed, got this nice little cabinet with some books and stuff on. The owner's given you like a little emergency basket here. And she was like, it's got everything you might have forgotten it just in case. And it's even got like false tan in it, a toothbrush, like so many little essentials. And I just think that's so cute, so cute. Um, so this is our little emergency basket. And then you just have a little bathroom here with a toilet and a shower. I think it's cute, made you. Nice and cute little cabin. It is at like the back of like the main house. So they have like the main house and it's at the back of the garden there. Um, it obviously was dark when we got here though and we're a bit sceptical about letting the dogs off when it's like dark just in case. So we'll just take them on their leads for like a little bit of a wonder tonight before bed around the garden. And then I might let them off tomorrow morning just for a bit of a sniff before we head out. But it's very cute, very nice, isn't it? And now you're so handsome. Yeah, you're so handsome. Mummy's handsome boy, yeah. Okay, so I've got my Kirsty's vegan cottage pie and then I've halved that pork bowl. Um, it's got rice and a bit of random stuff in it and Sean's going to have the other half, but this is dinner. Bon appetit. Sean's is in the oven. He's having curry. You all right? He's broke yeah. the little oven thing. <laughs> well, he hasn't. It's just gone off and we can't get it back on. I'm not sure what's happened. We arrived at the beautiful luxury rural hideaways in the heart of Herefordshire. This is Pointy Pina Hideaways and oh my god guys, it's absolutely beautiful. Surrounded by countryside, stunning views in the mornings when you wake up. When you wake up you've got the views of the Black Mountains. Now all of the lodges, there's three lodges on site and they all hold six people. So if you want to have a getaway with family or friends, it's perfect. Look at the size of the bath. It was so comfortable, honestly. It was such a huge bath and I am a bath girl so I was buzzing about this this is the bedrooms and they're just absolutely beautiful and then look the morning view I'm never gonna get over that it's so stunning Luna loved it she was like this is fun give me this ball and I'm gonna play the view of dreams is absolutely stunning here isn't it Sean so we're gonna take the pups for a walk we're gonna go walkie yeah and then we're gonna head into probably the local tesco at asda just to pick up some bits and pieces and then probably just come back and have a night in the hot tub chill it's so beautiful here um but there's a woodland just behind so we're gonna go explore that it has just started to rain a little bit so i've got the hood i've just pulled the glasses off my eye and i'm ready to go guys i wish i got it on camera sure it's just done a fucking <laughs> ski slope of mud down the hill was it hot in your mouth? Uh, <laughs> I don't know how you kept on your feet. <laughs> just, just managed it. at home mom's cooking his mints and he's been on a lovely woodland walk and he's like this is the holiday life <laughs> i love this little fairy light tree it's giving us christmas vibes so cute luna's agitated she's like i can smell my mints smell my mints it's lush yes isn't it sean it's like really nice sean's got like a indian banquet thing from tesco i've got a pizza thing um, so we're just cooking some tea and then I think we're going to go in the hot tub. I've got a few beverages, a bit of San Miguel. So the pup's tea is ready. They've got a spoonful of mince each. They're going for this 
um, Eden's the food that they get now and they really seem to like it. It's goose and rabbit. They do get the semi-dry, this one like throughout a date, like the semi-moist and then they get a tin at evening. Um, there's still a little bit of semi-moist in there from which was left over a day. So they've got half a tin between them, a scoop of mince and some dry. So this is their dinner and Luna is waiting eagerly. She's like, ma'am, I can smell that mint. It smells delish. Get it out. It needs to cool a minute. She's been staring at us like that for ages. She's like, I am starving. I have my pizza here. It's like a mushroom one from Plant Chef. And Sean is in the middle of preparing his Indian banquet. Fly a kite with our shoes off. Bus on the boom box. Weather never too hot. Little breeze is all I need. And off to the races. Watch it fly like a spaceship. You're taking me places starry eyed and complacent. We can fly a kite with our shoes off. Bus on the boom box. Weather never too hot. Little breeze is all I need. And off to the races. Watch it fly like a spaceship. You're taking me places starry eyed and complacent. Watch it catch the we had a lovely night last night. We chilled in the jacuzzi. What were the stars like, Sean? The stars were unreal. Like, you could just see them. They were beautiful. Um, we had our dinner, watched one episode of... What's that thing we started? Special commandment? No. Some... Designated Survivor. Designated Survivor. We've started that on Netflix. We watched an episode of that. I think it could be a good one. I think we yeah. could get I'm, into it. I'm in the place. So we'll probably watch more of that yeah. the night. But we're going to head to the little town. Oh, by the way, guys, I've been calling it. I was calling it Hiafordshire, where we are. Because to me, if I'm to say, like, here, get this, I say, yeah. Sean has informed us. What's it called? Oh. Herefordshire. So I'm very sorry. I'm very bad at pronunciation. Anyway, <coughs> well, that one's quite bad. <laughs> Herefordshire. But I just thought, well, my accent would say, yeah. I wouldn't say the rest. But anyway, Herefordshire, that's where we are because you probably won't understand where I said we were the first time. Anyway, we're gonna head to the little town. It's called Wyon Hay, I believe, probably pronouncing it wrong again. Um, but the owner of the lodge told me about it and said that it's a really nice little town. So we're gonna head there. It's a Sunday, so I'm not quite sure how much will be open, but we thought we'll just go anyway and have a look. Um, the pups have got their coats on because it's very windy. Henry looks like a little farmer and he's so handsome. But yeah, I don't know if you can see, but the tre trees are blowing a gale. <laughs> it's so windy. Like, we could really hear the wind last night. It was absolutely like... Drah! Anyway, we are getting sorted. And we're going to head out and see what the little town is like. It's very rural. I love it. It's just oh, fields everywhere. Just makes us sad that one day, like, because more and more houses are being built, I hope we still have rural areas like this. This random collie's just come from nowhere. It's very friendly, but I don't know where it's come from. Collie has attached itself to my leg. It's nibbling us and it's literally humping me. <laughs> darling, get off. Get off, darling. I can't get rid of him. I don't know where his mum is. I'm at like a sight. He's following us everywhere. Nibbling us, humping us. <laughs> I don't know where you live. I know, I'm sorry, darling. He's covered in shit. Get down, get down, I know, I know, get down darling, get down, yeah covered in poop, I don't want to smell a poop, <sighs> where do you live, I know, <laughs> you can't stop on this. Update, I did get the collie back to its owner so don't worry about it. But I am back home now, so that is going to end this vlog of our little trip. We had a brilliant three days. It was beautiful. It was a nice way to kind of end our trips for the year. We're not going to be going on anymore in 2023. So it's really nice to go away with the pups for a few days. And if you guys want a little hideaway that is so secluded, rural, so relaxing, then I would highly recommend where we went in Harifadja. It was absolutely beautiful. And I will have the link below so you can find out what dates they've got available. I do believe that there's discount on the remaining dates in December. So if you want to book a last minute little 
little getaway perfect opportunity however there will be all the dates available for 2024 as well so i'm going to have the link to them below make sure you click on it to have a little browse thank you so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you very shortly for another one bye it's the end of the year everywhere on tv couples and christmas trees 